Hi, my name is Teddy Anderson, and I perform the hoop dance. The reason I perform the hoop dance is really to inspire children and youth to arise and serve their communities and to really overcome the differences that separate us in society. And so in the hoop dance, when we talk about this, all these different things like gender inequalities, prejudice, racism, can be overcome by understanding the simple concept that we all belong to one human family. So my performance usually runs between 35 and 45 minutes. I start off with, uh, with a flute song, was taught to me by a man named Gary Badke, and he showed me this flute song, and it just helps to relax the audience and create a sense of focus. Then I say a prayer, and this prayer was taught to me by a man named Kevin Locke. And he showed me this prayer, and I think it really prepares our hearts to hear this really important message. Oh, great spirit, whose voice I hear in the wind, and whose breath gives life to all the world, hear me. I am small and weak, one of your many children am I. Make me walk. Then I do two hoop dances. I do one with six hoops. and one with 30 hoops. And after each hoop dance, I like to go over what I just did and explain it to the audience in detail and show them really the symbolism of what this means and what I'm trying to convey. In your culture, you learn to stand tall and proud, just like a tree. And you slowly learn more and more from your teachers, your neighbors, your elders, even your hoop dancers. <laughs> you take this knowledge onto your wings. The wings of knowledge. And when you use... You know and after that, I invite the audience up to do some participatory things with me. So we do some hoop dancing, we do some round dancing, teachers come up, students come up, and then we have some questions just to close um, it off. I, what do you think? Do you, if all these colors come together, do you think we can live happily with each other? No. Yeah, so it starts with us, right? It starts with us. Good question. My goal is to really create a, a strong sense between the audience and myself that we can really unite and overcome these differences that, that children, especially children and youth, may be facing in schools. Whatever we have in our heart, that's the knowledge we share with everyone every day. So I want you to imagine if someone has hatred in their heart, prejudice, racism, all these horrible things in their heart, that's what they give off through their friendships and their, you know, all their interactions. But imagine if we have love, compassion, respect, generosity, patience, appreciation, all of those things in our heart, that's what we give off.